I have a feeling somebody is going to freak out. Whoa, Joy, that was loud. I'm usually the loud one. What's up? Well, I can't really tell you right now because I'm trying to keep things under control. But I have a feeling that fear is going to be very freaked out. Why is that? Um, look at the back. I don't see anything. You need to look higher. <gasps> what is that? It's us. What do you mean it's us? We are here. You are here. I'm here. A little bigger and taller. Hi, guys. So, anybody see my brush? And I look like everywhere. It's not like we have another disgust in the house. Oh, uh, well, actually, about that, uh, there is another disgust in the house. What are you talking about? I've been feeling a little extra emotional. I'm like feeling sad. It's almost like there is more sadness around me. Oh, uh, well, sadness, yes. Actually, uh, there is more sadness around you. What do you mean? Okay, emotions, I need your help. Of course, Joy. What's up? What is the plan? Well, if you look in the back, you'll see that we are not alone. Us, in the bigger version, took over our headquarters. And they are giants! So that's who got my brush! Mm. Well, right now, our priority is to keep fear nice and calm. Did someone call me? Yes, fear, we need you to keep calm because there is another fear in the house and you are going to freak out. What? Disgust, you were not supposed to be saying that. Fear, just don't look back and everything will be good. You can't tell somebody don't look back because they will look back. Ah! What's going on? Hello, friends. Welcome back to Sweet and Crafty. Mama Z is here. Looks like our emotions a little bit stressed out. I think we need to do some fun activity to calm them down. So I have this activity book inside my mind, a book about me. It has puzzles, activities, doodles, and much more and there are definitely lots of activities i just saw an answer key in the back we have some information about riley's emotions let's see what it says right here it says joy find the fun in every day now sadness goodbyes make me feel like a wilted flower ah anger fight the good Fight and fear. Be careful and watch out for everything. Disgust in the back. Just don't do anything that would make you say ill. And we even have Bing Bong. Hi, cha cha. So long, friend. The first page this book belongs to. You write your name, date. I am. I put your age right now. This is how you feel. You put emotion is in charge of my headquarters. Next page, we have some information about Riley. Pretty much everyone in my family skates. It's kind of a family tradition. We go out on the lake almost every weekend. Riley is 11 year old girl and in the new movie she is the teenager. Moved from Minnesota to San Francisco with her mom and dad. As she struggles to adjust to her new home, Riley's happy personality starts to fade. Here is joy, sadness, anger, fear, disgust, and imaginary friend Bing Bon. Are you ready? Grab a pen or pencil and join Riley and her emotions on a journey inside your mind. Oh, cool. We even have chapters here. Okay, so let's do chapter one, Joy. Okay, I'm trying to find some games that we can play. Because this is, I feel like, more personal stuff, you know? But games we can all play together. Oh, cool. Travel games. Check it out. So, I love road trips. We go on road trips with our small family. And here are some games that you can play name that tune we all like playing that one next is 20 questions first pick a category categories can be anything like animals food things at the beach uh, hobbies etc the first answer thinks of something that falls under the chosen category everyone else is a questionnaire questionnaires take turns asking yes or no questions such as is it big does it smell bad can i eat it please can ask up to 20 years or no questions the questionnaire who guesses correctly becomes the next answer okay next one is backseat bingo what do you need bingo cards 
and so open and then you play uh, bingo alphabet city is also really really fun or you can play animal game the same way next one is double the joy which two pictures of joy are exactly alike okay finally we got to play the game i'm gonna get my yellow well this one's kind of like yellowish orangish marker okay so let's cross this one out also we are going to cross this one out because i'm looking at spheres they are very different so now we're looking between a c and e this one is not the same because joy doesn't have designs on her dress so a and e are the right answer next we have happy word search let's do the word search and it's a happy one, that's awesome. And these are the words that we need to find. Klaus, dessert, family, food, french fries, friends, hockey, skating, and trophies. The tricky part is that some of the words go in reverse, like upside down. For example, like skating, it took me some time to find. Dessert is also upside down. And then we have family, trophies, backwards, hockey, French fries, clouds, friends, and we found them all. Next is the puzzle, puzzled in headquarters. Can you find where each puzzle piece belongs in the picture of headquarters below? So first one, I see sadness and disgust, which is E right here. Next I see top of Joy's head, so that's gonna be D, spheres. C goes right here, then this one is the bottom B, and this will make it A. Okay, memory dump maze madness. Okay, let's start. Help Joy and Bing Bong find their way out of the memory dump. Let's go. Sweet, that was actually easy. Chapter two, we have sadness. Oh, sadness. I hope you are not feeling very sad today. Also, disgust. Why do you turn around? Pay attention. All right, so here's different information about sadness as well as how sadness made Riley feel. Look how upset Riley was when her teddy bear broke. Sadness turns memory spheres blue when she touches them. Try this activity and turn something blue. What you need? Celery, a knife, water, a jar of drinking glass, blue food coloring and spool. Fill a jar of drinking glass about halfway with water. Squeeze enough blue food coloring into the water to make it turn nice deep shade of blue. Ask an adult to help trim about one inch of the bottom of celery stalks. Put the celery stalks into the blue water so that leaves are sticking out of the jar of glass. Here comes the tough part, waiting. Yeah, let the celery sit in the jar or glass overnight. The longer you leave the celery water, the bluer it will get. I'm totally on it. Okay, it's raining. Why does sadness like the rain? Use the decoder to find the answer. It makes everything feel droopy. What kind of explanation is that? <laughs> Chapter three, anger, great ideas. The emotions use idea bulbs to put an idea into Riley's mind. Fill in the following bulbs with ideas that have popped into your head lately. Well, I'm very adventurous, so I love to go on different adventures. I recently went and surprised my friend in Georgia for her birthday. So I'm gonna put Georgia trip. I also love go camping woods walk and i have a jeep so i love to go wheeling go off-roading more words to find how not to ruin pizza another recipe whoa very cool i love these recipes and they seem very very easy too you actually make pizza on sliced english muffin you need toaster oven baking sheet aluminum foil olive oil tomato sauce or sliced tomatoes shredded mozzarella cheese and it already sounds delicious another recipe wow we got lots of recipes in anchor chapter 
Anger's likes and dislikes. Anger has very strong opinions about, well, everything. <laughs> Half of the words on the list below are things that Anger likes and dislikes. Can you figure out which are which? Separate the list into likes and dislikes and place each word in the correct space to solve the crossword puzzle on the following page. Do you guys think he likes San Francisco or dislikes? I think he does not like it. And we are going to write it right here because this looks like the longest word. Next is spitting. Do you think he likes spitting or no? I'll keep this one out for now because I'm not sure where it's gonna go. Yelling. I think he likes yelling, but again, I'm not 100% sure. What about yoga? I think he dislikes yoga and I'm gonna put it right here because I think that's where it's supposed to go. Next is aromatherapy. I guess he dislikes it and it also goes right here. Growling. I think he likes growling. I think he likes fairness too. What about dessert? I think he likes dessert. He does not like hugs. He does not like injustice either. All right, so we are looking for three more words. This one is dessert, so he likes dessert. Who doesn't, right? I like dessert, I just cannot have it. <laughs> All right, next is spitting and yelling. And he likes both. Ooh, next one is chapter for fear. Which two pictures of fear match exactly? We have six different fear versions. Uh, definitely not A because it doesn't have a pattern on his vest. They all have bow, however, this bow doesn't have the details, so it's not A. Looks like all of them have the same shoes. What about the water bucket? Water bucket looks the same also. All these four look like they are the same to me. I'm gonna look at page 121 for the right answer. It says B and D are the same. B and D. So why this one and this one not the same? Oh, okay, so there is no little uh, hair strain right here. And now why this one is not the same as that one. Uh, oh, it's so confusing. Do you guys see anything? I don't know. I'm giving up on this one because I don't see the difference. A disguise chapter. Let's see what fun games we have here. Very cool. You can play disgusting charades. And here is a list to get you started. Finding a bug in your bowl of cereal. Opening a fridge full of rotten fish. Drinking a glass of curled milk. Ew. Falling into dumpster. Ugh. Waking up with a frog on your pillow. What? Unless you're in the jungle or camping, maybe. Okay, more words to find. Absolutely disgusting. Ooh, this game looks so fun. Who's in charge? Answer these questions and follow the path to find out who would be driving your headquarters if Riley's emotions were in charge. So start here. All right, let's answer these questions. If I were an animal, I would be a tail wagging pup or no way. Animal smell. I would absolutely be a pup. <laughs> okay, so go this way. Right now, I feel like curling up into a ball, dancing up a spiral staircase. I feel a little sad. So actually, I'm gonna go curling up into a ball. Now from this one, we're gonna go to, I wish I could, bubble wrap the world. Hmm, why would you do that? Or give the world a great big hug. I would definitely give the world a great big hug. From here, we're gonna go right here. The forecast inside my mind is 82 degrees and nice breezy day, 46 degrees, 99.9% point, .9 chance of rain. Breezy day and nice weather. Oh, cool, I'm Joy. You guys wanna play broccoli trap? Help discuss, get safely through the maze while avoiding the broccoli. All right, well, this was super duper easy. Next is Bing Bong. I'm gonna take lavender color marker that I was going to use with fear and find a couple more games before we finish this activity. Ooh, let's play this one. Facts and opinions. Joy and Bing Bong are having trouble sorting the facts from the opinions. 
help them by circling fact or opinion for each statement. Okay. Riley plays hockey. Is it fact or opinion? Well, it's definitely a fact. Bing Bong cries candy. It's also a fact. Sun powered rockets are the best way to get around. Mm, that's opinion. Hockey is fun. Uh, honestly, I think most people who love sports would say it's a fact, but I think it's an opinion. Imaginary friends should stay around forever. That's, hmm, can be both, but I'd just say opinion. Joy is Riley's lead emotion. That's a fact. Riley used to live in Minnesota. That's also a fact. Pizza in San Francisco is terrible. That's an opinion. <laughs> but I've never been to San Francisco, neither I have never tried their pizza, so I don't know. This book is awesome and I think it's definitely a perfect activity to take with you if you are on a road trip or vacation or something like that. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!